guys, it's Elisa, and today I'm coming to you guys with a brand new video, and it's an actually very exciting video. I'm going to show you guys how to get this look, but not only that, I'm also going to be doing a, doing a first impression of most of the products that are shown in this video. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, and share if you did, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye! Okay, so as you guys can see, I already have my foundation routine on and my eyebrows, which is perfect. So we could just get into all of the first impressions. So the first thing that I want to try is a translucent powder. It is a drugstore translucent powder, and it's by e.l.f. It literally costs $6. It's so affordable. And I'm just going to open it, and I'm going to use this to bake. For the rest of my face, I'm going to be using my tried and true Black Radiance Pressed Powder. Okay, so moving on to my eyes, I'm just going to prime with the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. Since this is a soft glam makeup look and we're mostly trying to focus our eyes on the eyelashes, for the lid we're going to be taking a skin toned eyeshadow. And then using the same brush from before, we're just going to blend it all up. Next up is eyeliner. I'm actually going to do this part off camera so I can have a really good wing. Next, I'm going to be applying our second first review product. These are the Eye Envy Kiss Eyelashes in All Natural in 02. Before we apply the eyelashes though, we have to go in with a mascara for our natural lashes. Yet again, another part that I can't really do on camera, I'll be back when the lashes are The lashes are now applied. I'm not necessarily sure if I would classify these as all natural, but I really do like this. Next up, we're going to be using the same blush that we used to apply the powder to wipe it off. As for the e.l.f. powder, I really do like how covered and matte my face looks. Um, it really does brighten up the concealer that I use to highlight underneath my eyes. Next up is the part that I'm most excited about. I'm going to be using ColourPop highlighter in the color Glow Up. This is from the Karuchi collection, the K-pop collection. I've never even opened this before, so yeah. And this is also my first product I've ever gotten from ColourPop, which makes it even more exciting i can't even using a brush isn't really working so i'm just going to use my finger i'm going to be taking the blush that i attempted to use with this to just blend it out and then afterwards i'm just going to put this on the tip of my nose and also above my cupid as well. Next, taking a blush brush, I'm gonna be putting a pinkish toned blush on my cheek. The next product I'm gonna be trying out is a ColourPop lipstick actually, and it is in the color Avenue. This is way more red than I expected it to look. So that I can show you guys a, the full natural color, I did not apply a lip liner, but for this color, I'm pretty sure you really should. One thing I can already say that I like about this product is that it dries so quick. Now taking the last product and the last first review product, I'm going to be taking my NYX Matte Finish Spray. And this is the finished look. I hope you guys liked that short video. I loved all of the products that I tried out, which is an A plus for me. I always love getting new products. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys later. Bye.